you, I'm Robert Scoble, and we're here at the Rackspace studio at TechCrunch Disrupt 2012. What you might not know is that there's a, a startup competition going on here all three days, and it ends up with, uh, I think, seven companies who are battling it out for a $100,000 check or something like that. You know, so, some really famous companies have, have won it in the past, like Mint and uh, Yammer. You know, Yammer got bought for a billion dollars by Microsoft. Those guys won uh, uh, several years ago. And so uh, I'm talking to one of the finalists, one of the guys who are in the hunt for the uh, the big check, and really an honor to talk to Seiya, who is from uh, Ghana, right? <laughs> so, uh, anyways, let's start it. Who are you? I'm Robert Lamte from Ghana. Yeah, and uh, wh what is it that you're doing? So we're sort of like the eye messages for feature points. Um, where we come from, one to five percent of the population have smartphones. The rest of the people are stuck with non-smartphones. They're, they're these, on these single chip Nokia yeah, phones, single very chip low Nokia, cost. Yes, and it, quite um, recently the Chinese phones with two SIMs and the like. And so these guys don't have applications that are beautifying messaging for them. That's not the only problem. Um, most mobile subscriptions are not uh, subscription based, yeah, but I prepaid, pay as you go. So the more messages you send, the more expensive it gets. And we are, my co-founder and I are engineers, and we are like, let's build an application that will cut the cost of SMS for us, and also beautify messaging for our non smart very cool. So does it use the SMS system, or does it use uh, an IP system? So, like? yeah, it uses data. Um, so IP, yeah. right? Um, the thing is, in Africa, right, um, SMS is like 2.5 cents per message. But data is so cheap. Data is like 1 cent per megabyte. And so looking at 160 characters and looking at 1 megabyte, you could send so many messages. You just need 1 cent on our system yeah. to be able to just send messages for a whole month. Interesting. I, you know, uh, I was just at the Apple event this morning and looking at the beautiful new iPhone. You're probably not going to see very many of those in yeah, uh, Ghana, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, and, 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 and the interesting thing is, once we pushed the app there for a beta, right, we, we got to see that it wasn't just a Ghana issue. People in India, in Indonesia, even Syria, were using their application. God knows what they were using it for, right? But, so. It's, it's a big problem in emerging markets. It's not just an African issue. How many people are using your system so far? So our beta had 400,000 downloads in two months and um, 80,000 users. And you see, we um, send SMS invitations. So we use SMS to kill SMS. Our invitations have download links. So people receive an SMS and they download. And what we do is say our pays for sending the SMSs to these people. And at a point in time, the thing got so viral, we couldn't even afford to send the SMS. And so we have actually a backlog of 9 million SMS invitations to send for a beta. That's crazy. Really. That's crazy. <laughs> so how are you funded? Are, are you uh, looking for funding? Or? Yeah, so the primary reason we came to Sun Fund was to raise venture capital. But we've had angel funding from the Northwater Foundation, they have their headquarters in San Fran and an Accra office. So they give us angel funding um, to build the application and prove that it's something that would solve the problem we thought it would solve. And so far, so really good. Very cool. Yeah, you're a finalist, so that means you're in the top seven out of yeah. uh, how many companies? Like 50 companies? I think, yeah, something like 30 that. to 50, something. Yeah. yeah. And what does that mean to your company? Does that help you get visibility? Well, it obviously got you on TechCrunch last night, so gets you visibility. What else What else yeah. has happened to you since you've been a finalist? So before we got to San Fran, right, I was on the plane. I was talking to my co-founder, and we were like, two years ago, we used to watch TechCrunch Disrupt. Right? We used to watch and see all the cool ideas. And these ideas inspired us back in Africa to start creating stuff because we believe we can use software to solve problems. And then all of a sudden, we are at TechCrunch presenting. We are not watching, we are being watched. And the fun part and really amazing thing was we had tweets and calls back home. People in Kenya were projecting it. People in Uganda, I Cote d'Ivoire, Ghana, in schools, in universities, and they were projecting TechCrunch, our presentation, everyone was watching. That's so awesome. for us, it's not about 
to win Taekwondo is wrapped again, but it's about inspiration. Inspiring the next generation of software entrepreneurs in Africa. Very cool. What other startups are you seeing have, uh, come out of Ghana? What, you know, what, is there a group of companies that's forming? Or, yeah, or are so, you the only one? <laughs> no. um, so there are lots of interesting startups in Africa, um, especially in Ghana. So my, I, my office is in an incubator that has 11 other companies. And one company you actually interviewed, I think, last year or two years ago at the launch conference, right? Um, so 11 kick ass companies in our incubator. We have other incubators in Accra. Um, I think a total, the tech scene in Accra, you could get about 50 to 70 tech startups. And that's not just Ghana. You go to Kenya, there's lots of activities happening there. You go to Nigeria, the tech scene is picking up. So I think that being here, um, it's an inspiration to everybody to see that, yes, build the product. If it works, people would use it. And things will follow from there. Very cool. Well, good luck to you this afternoon. You're Thank you're you. back on stage. Uh, yeah, as your final. The next one, uh, <laughs> Very cool. I'll let you go prepare. Uh, Thank thanks you. for spending Thank a little you. bit of time with me, and uh, good luck. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you.